The team detected the presence of dimethyl sulfide and dimethyl disulfide in the atmosphere of K218b. In the search for extraterrestrial life, scientists have focused their attention on exoplanets located within the habitable zone of their host stars. This zone, also known as the Goldilocks zone, represents the sweet spot where conditions are just right, not too hot, not too cold, for liquid water to exist on a planet's surface. Water, as we know it, is essential for life as we know it. K218b, located 124 light-years away in the constellation Leo, is one such exoplanet that lies within the habitable zone of its host star, a red dwarf star smaller and cooler than our Sun. In 2025, a team of astronomers from Cambridge University, led by Professor Niku Madhusudan, made a groundbreaking discovery using data from the James Webb Space Telescope. This powerful telescope, launched in 2021, is designed to observe the universe in infrared light, allowing it to penetrate clouds of gas and dust that obscure visible light. The team detected the presence of dimethyl sulfide and dimethyl disulfide in the atmosphere of K218b. These molecules, while not conclusive proof of life, are considered potential biosignatures, meaning they could be indicators of biological activity. On Earth, dimethyl sulfide is primarily produced by marine phytoplankton, tiny organisms that play a crucial role in the planet's ecosystem. These microscopic algae release DMS into the atmosphere as a byproduct of their metabolic processes. The detection of DMS in the atmosphere of K218b, therefore, raises the intriguing possibility that similar life forms might exist on this distant world. While DMS can also be produced through non-biological processes, such as volcanic activity, the presence of DMDS alongside DMS strengthens the case for a biological origin.